Hi guys, here's our step-by-step -step video on how to mine 0xBTC using your NVIDIA GPUs. So if you just go over to our website, wolfpool.io, and scroll on down, and here you've got Start Mining with NVIDIA. Click on the How to Connect, and you can download our pre-configured Hashburner V3 miner from here, so just click on that. Show that in the folder. Now we need to extract this file because it's zipped. So we go extract here. And there we go. Now you can save this wherever you want, guys. Some people like to uh, save it in the root C drive. Just for ease for this video, I'm just going to put this onto the desktop. You won't get that, it's because I've already got one there, but there we go so I've pasted that over to the desktop so if we open this we will have these files here now you want to open this cosmic now the first thing we need to do is set the account so this is your ethereum address which is going to tell the pool where to pay your rewards to so all we need to do here if you look back on the website you type account select and then put your eth address in so you can type this or you can copy it whatever you prefer now just to let you all know to paste into this you can't click control v you have to just right click and that is paste so right click the mouse and then it pastes that in so account select and then space and then you need to put in your ethereum address so i've got my ethereum address here copy Remember, it's right click to paste. Right click. Okay. Now that has selected the account. Now we need to tell it what pool to connect to. So if we go back to the website, you can see here you've got pool select and then the details for the pool. So if we copy all of this text, oh, copy, go back back to the software remember right click pull select and there it is press enter now we've selected both the account and the pool so to start mining all you need to do is type pool mine CUDA now stick with me guys I'm going to show you how to actually start mining easier and also if you're using multiple NVIDIA GPUs you do need to do something else to get it mining on all of those as well because I am actually using a three GPU system here uh, but as you can see that's only started uh, one GPU so let's close that for now and we're finished with the website now so as long as you downloaded our pre-configured miner from our website you will also have this file in here start all gpu.bat so if we edit that if this pops up saying what program would you like to open this with make sure you click notepad and you'll get this now if you're like I say I'm mining with a, a 3 GPU system here but you might have 5 you might have 10 I don't know how many you've got but each one of these lines starts one GPU so as you can see here, this starts 0, 1, 2, 3, and 4. So let's say you've got a, I don't know, a, a, a 6 GPU system. Okay, so we've, we've got 5 on this list. So we need to add one more. So we'll copy that. Paste that into there. And there we go, there's now 6. Now we still need to tell it to launch GPU 5. So if we change that there to 5, the other bit you have to change is the devices. So change that to 5. And that is all you need to do for this. Now, you may only be using a 1 GPU system. It's still easier to use this file, and, and I'll show you why. Um, the other part you can change, but you don't have to. Some people are OCD. If you want to, that's fine, is this here. So which graphics card you're using. Um, now I'm not actually mining with 1070 Ti's here, so I haven't bothered changing this. I'm mining on 1070's. 
but you know if you're mining on a I don't know a, a 1060 just type 1060 in there uh, but like I say guys you don't actually have to change that if you don't want to it doesn't really matter so I'm mining on a a three GPU system so I need three of these lines so I'm going to get rid of those there and there we go so that will start GPU 1 GPU 0 1 and 2 now close that make sure you save this guys and then all you do is click start all GPU now even if you're only mining on one GPU it's still easier to use that file purely because you can shortcut to it and you don't have to type the command pull mine CUDA so I'm going to show you well first of all this is how I arrange things out you know you don't have to do this they will sit in the background mining but it's nice to be able to see what, what you know what hash rates you're getting um, so I like to just arrange them like that and that's it my three GPU system is now mining on all three GPUs but let's say for example you're only mining on one if you don't use that file every time you've got to open this and type pull mine CUDA and it will start now granted that's not very difficult but personally I like it even easier just to you know double click something on the desktop so if we close this if we go to start all G oh sorry if we go to edit the start all GPU and if, if we've only got one GPU you only need one line so you just need it to tell tell it to start GPU 0 so if I save that I can now send a sh send that to the desktop as a shortcut and I'll rename that to start mining uh, 0 xbtc and that's it so it, rather than having to open that and type pull mine CUDA you can just double click on that and it'll open one GPU now something else to be aware of guys uh, obviously you can use any ethereum address um, for your account but you must use an ethereum address that you own the private keys for so you know make sure you're not using uh, an ethereum address that you've got from an exchange like bitrex or, or binance or anything you must own the private keys okay guys well that's how you mine 0 xbtc on nvidia if you have any problems please feel free to jump on our discord and our account our support staff are, are happy to help thanks a lot bye bye